Kesällä kukkii asiat ja syksyllä mätänee asiat. Call of Duty Modern Warfare on nyt vuorossa. Onko sinä minkälaisia saavutuksia sinä Modern Warfareissa? Spekshop, jossa kuulemma neljä tehtävää. 26 kampanjan saavutusta. Onko ne mahdollisia saada? Kaikki saavutukset tänne ei ole mahdollisia saada. Edes hyvällä tahdolla. Sneaky snake. Kumma juttu, että nämä venäläiset eivät ole saaneet pysäytettyä tätä snakeä. Nyt se vaan on tappanut taas meiltä yhden superhirvityksen. Nää ainakin toimii. Okei, okay, ihan hyvä. Steamin saavutuksissa niin välillä on tullut juttua siitä, että on ollut jotain tosi sairasta sillä, että ei meinaa niin kuin millään tavalla saada. Tää näyttää nyt siltä, että tulee pomotappelu. Ei, kutsi. Joudutaan tonne hiippailemaan. Se hiip hitaasti löytystelee kyllä. Ettiinkö nää jotain vai onko ne vaan muuten vaan näin? Mikä muuten se saavutus oli siinä tracing-luettelissä, joka ei toimi? On muuten parempi ääreisnäkö kuin myöhempien pelien supersotilailla. Ammuksia. Venäjällä. Tarkovissa se jotenkin vielä oli ehkä. Tuo vartija on tuolla kaukana. Smooth 
Hunteri pois. Ja vaihdetaan muuten tässä vaiheessa toi Kamokin päälle. Tää taisi olla ihan kohtuullisen hyvä. Kasvot smustaks. Tähän ei ole tehokkaan mahdollinen toi, että pistää kasvot täysin mustaks. Black. Oi oi, 70 prosenttia. Hei! Tätä norsukin nukahtas. It's just my imagination. Ei ole. Oh. Ha! Mitä valot nyt oli yli? Noniin, se oli sillä lailla, kun pitikin. Supervakoja ei katso. Katso nyt siivoja. Akin pona vaan periaatteessa ampuu tuolla. Okei, okay, tää toimi. Päästiin viimeinkin sisään. No niin, mitä asia? Snake, that door can't be opened by normal means. Apparently it operates by responding to a specific Aha. radio frequency. If you want to know the key frequency, Okay, let's try asking someone nearby. 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 Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh. Snake, have you ever seen Invasion of the Body Snatchers? Yes, I will admit it. No, I haven't. It's about this town where one by one the people disappear and are replaced by someone else. It keeps getting worse and worse until finally the main character's friends and family start getting replaced. It turns out it was a giant plant thing producing human clones. Creepy, huh? Clones? A clone is a body or cell that's genetically identical to another one. They didn't use that term in the movie, though. <laughs> you mean a copy of a human being? It's technologically <laughs> feasible. We know it's possible to do it in theory. Big boss is that it? That's the cover. That's the snake. Is that the next clone? One day, maybe toward the beginning of the next century, the super soldiers like you are going to be a hot topic. Metal Gear, you're going to be a hot topic. Metal Gear, solid player. Just to make copies of me. Precisely. Like a thoroughbred horse. Right. Huh. Hmm. You know they never allow it. Maybe, but technology changes people. We can't predict how people will think 50 years from now. Some things shouldn't be changed. We're not the ones who decide that. I think maybe the only thing we can do is to try and pass on our beliefs to our children, so that they won't head in the wrong direction. Kartola muuten majurlanta. Mitä niin ja? You've infiltrated the East Wing. Rykov should be somewhere in that building. Take him down and steal his clothes. Okei, niin mun täytyy tietty tietty tyyppi. Pidättää tai ottaa siltä vaatteet. Jaa. Aavikkokuviointi sopii vessaan. Se taisi olla juuri... Juuri tämän tyyppi, joka poistuu. Juuri tuonne. Onko siellä yksi vielä tai joku? Onneksi se on sillä lailla pyörii kohtuullisen lähellä kaapistoon. Ei. Toi on kyllä huonoa tuuria vaan. Ai se painoi nappiakin kaiken niin. Taas ihan pyllylleen.
kärpä on täällä. Tää täytyy saada yläkertaa. Minne on ihan järkyttävä matka. Se saa kaappiin, että mä saan sen uniformun. Sitten mä ehkä tarvii vielä ottaa vanki. Joka ei ole tähän mennessä onnistunut yht yhtään mitenkään. Tän takia mä napsuttelen noita vartioita aina pois, koska joku voi tulla jostain sattumanvarasta suunnasta ja vaan löytää sen. Okei, no niin. Ha! Kerrankin. Viimeinkin. Pääsimme, pääsimme kohteeseen. Eikä tarvinnut kuuttu kymmenen tyyppiä vaan tainuttaa matkalla. Tuo on kyllä Raidenin näköinen toi. Ei päristä. Mikä toi nyt on? Mä en nyt Raidenin kuva vielä kaapin sisäpinnalla oli. Noni. Mulla on luultavasti toi uniformu nyt. Se meni varmaan alas tai jonnekin. Eikö tossa? Sir. Yritetään sitten uudestaan. Mulla on vaan toi näppäin yhdistelmä, ei millään tavalla, tai sen nappien yhdistelmä, niin... Millään tavalla niin kun selkeä, että mitä... Mä en ottanut vankeja aikaisemmin tässä pelissä. Freeze. Ah! Okei, okay, tätä piti painaa pohjaa. The door will open with frequency 148. 48. 1.3. Ah, your Rykov disguise has turned out nicely. Yeah, not even his own mother could tell the difference. Indeed, you're Yo. starting to irritate me already. Why? This look should make me more popular. Uh, I wouldn't bet on it, but whatever. MGS Kakkone. Now that you're indistinguishable from the real Rykov, you'll be able to get into the West, West wing, wing, to which only Volgin and Rykov have access. Head for the West Wing of the Weapons Lab. That's where Sokolov is being held. Enter the main wing from the second floor of the East Wing. Okay, that gets Pass west through the main wing, and you'll come to a connecting passageway. The West Wing is at the other end of that passageway. Infiltrate the West Wing and rescue Sokolov. Sir. 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 West Wing Corridor. No niin, nyt on oikeassa paikassa. sisään. Kai sitten. Hyvä homma. Ei siinä mennykään kuin puolet jäisyydestä. Ei näköjään toi shaderin puki vieläkään toimi. Here it is. Sen asetuksesta varmaan taas. 
You can Come count up. on me. What about the philosopher's legacy? I don't know anything about that. What are you? Are you trying to kill me? What's the matter? <gasps> I know nothing, I swear it. <gasps> no one but the Colonel knows of the legacy. I see. No, don't! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who's there? You're the man from the CIA. What are you doing here? I told you before, didn't I? I'm going to get you out of here. <laughs> A man of honor, just like your commander. But I'm afraid you're too late. Too late? Don't tell me, the Shagahads. <laughs> exactly. The final preparations for Phase 2 are complete. Sokolov, what exactly is Phase 2? I'm a lupo. To put it in technical terms, it's a composite range extension system for medium-range ballistic missiles. The Shagahod was originally designed as a tank that could launch nuclear missiles from any type of terrain. There was just one problem we couldn't figure out how to solve. The ICBMs we have today are simply too big for the Shagohod to carry. But the military would not hear of it. They demanded a weapon that could launch a nuclear missile directly into the American homeland. That is when I came up with the idea for Phase 2. But there's no way you could load an ICBM onto the Shagahod. So how do you do it? By accelerating the Shagohod itself. Uh-huh. Accelerating it. In phase two, a rocket booster unit is attached to the frame of the Shagohod. The unit incorporates the same technology used in the Vostok rocket that uh -huh. sent Major Gagarin into space. Using this booster, the Shagohod can achieve a land speed of over 300 miles per hour. That monster can go more than 300 miles per hour? Yes. And from this state of accelerated motion, it launches a nuclear missile. So, the Shagohod acts like the first stage of a rocket. Yes, precisely. The range of the missile launched by the Shagohod thus increases from 2500 miles to 6000 miles. 6000 miles? No, it's not a that's enough to strike anywhere in the United States. Not only that, with the Shagohod, there's no need to construct giant silos like the ones used to house ICBMs. It's is a runway about three miles in length, or its equivalent. That can nuclear strike against any location in the United States from anywhere in the Soviet Union. It spy planes or satellites. It's a mobile fortress, capable of deploying in secret and launching its payload at any time. A weapon from hell. Thank you, Kabo Yampo Yudina. Mr. Tasa Milotansa, who has a problem with the Kitara? The only one of its kind. But Volkin is planning to mass produce them based on that prototype and deploy them all over the Soviet Union. Yes, and that's not the end of it. He's going to ship them to Eastern Europe, to Asia, to all the countries of the Eastern Bloc. Even worse, he intends to use the Shagohad as bait to foment armed uprisings among dictators, ethnic insurgents, and revolutionary groups throughout the Third World. Yeah, His funds stuff. are nearly limitless. He could start mass production tomorrow if he wanted. The reason that tensions between East and West have settled into a Cold War is because each side fears the other's power. Deterrence. 
The idea of using threats to keep one's enemy in check is the perfect word to sum up this state of affairs. But the Shago Heart goes far beyond the level of threat. It will render the concept of deterrence utterly meaningless. If such a weapon is unleashed on the world, it will not be long before all nations are engulfed in conflict. The Cold War will end, and the entire planet will be consumed by the fires of war. Vulcan and the Shago Heart will be at the center of it all. So you see, it's already too late. No, it's not too late. What do you mean? We've still got a chance. All we have to do is destroy the prototype and the whole facility before they can mass produce it. But just tell me what I need to do to destroy this place. <laughs> All right. The liquid fuel used in the rocket engine is stored in a tank. If you can blow it up somehow. Hernobeli C3 ought to be enough to blow the entire hangar to smithereens. C3. You mean that cutting-edge plastic explosive? It could be molded into any shape. The bomb of the future. Where can I get it? There was some in the armory here, but it's gone now. It was stolen by a female spy who was here a minute ago. Uh. No, that's not her name. Her name is Tatiana. She made her way in here by becoming Vulcan's lover. I thought she was your lover. <laughs> Mine? Oh, no. She is Volgin's lover. Hmm. This is my lover. Millä puolella? Mistä kolmoisagentti tietää, millä puolella se on? Who are they? My wife and daughter. They're in America. Now I remember. Your family is in the custody of the CIA. Tai siis tarkoitan sitä, että vanhalla miehellä voisi olla rakastaja. How long has Tatiana been here? Only a few weeks. A few days before the virtuous mission then. Okay, Ebertova. She said that Khrushchev sent her. Okay, Ebertova. What did you just give her? All of the experimental data for the Shago Hod. Please, it is essential that you destroy the Shago Hod. I will, but first I've got to get you to safety. <sighs> no, I'm not going. My mission is to rescue you. Leave me, Sokolov! Khrushchev has abandoned me. I cannot return to my country. I would most certainly be sent to the Gulags. You've been done in the US. Yes, I once thought of that. My family's waiting for me there. But even if I fled to the United States. I would once again find myself creating weapons of mass murder. In the end, it doesn't matter where I go. I am still a weapons scientist. To be honest with you, I'm tired. Every day I help create things that should never be used. Things that should never have existed in the first place. Every day, without sleep. Not a word of praise from others. And my creations do not even benefit mankind. They are merely the tools of politicians. All I wanted to do was build spycats. But it was not to be. The space race between America and Russia became the prey of politicians. The space race and the arms race are one and the same. Missiles, rockets, what's the difference? Scientists are always being used. Please, watch over my family. Me 
Major. What are you doing here? I've been waiting for you in my room. Dumb with me. If you think you can fool me, you're sorely mistaken. I know the Major better than anyone else. I come here looking for Tatiana, and what should I find? But a greasy freebooter. Uh-huh. What is this fairy disguise? It's gonna rub off on you. And then you'll lose sight of who you really are. Kaikki vähän omalla puolellaan. I see why they call you the boss. What was that? Some kind of judo? No, it's called CQC, a basic form of close quarters combat. He and I developed it together. Splendid. I'll take it from here. Are you going to kill him? Of course. But first, I will make him pay for hurting Ivan. You gotta do it. Metalkerpeleissä aika yleistä, että päähenkilö jää jossain vaiheessa vangiksi. Sanotte oikein tykkää tästä tilanteesta. Se on itse voittaa Snakein niin taistelussa. Tell me! Stop it! Who have you been talking to? He doesn't know what you're talking about. You'd better start talking. Please, stop this! Who is Khrushchev's lapdog? How can you do this to him? I know you gave the data to someone. Never do that. You! 
He's dead. <laughs> now then, hmm. I hope you'll prove more entertaining than he was. But first. Let's take a look at your body, shall we? Hmm. You've certainly seen your share of battles. <laughs> Consider yourself lucky. I am about to show you what hell is really like. Well then, let's get started. Ouch. What is your target? Ouch. Is it the Shagohad? <laughs> or Sokolov? <laughs> or maybe it's the Legacy? <laughs> Answer me! Who is helping you? <laughs> Who let you in here? <laughs> You're a tough one. But even you must have your limits. And I am a patient man. Ei sentään tarvinnut hakata nappia niin kuin edellisessä peleissä. Okei. Okay. Here's where the fun really begins. My body carries an electric charge of 10 million volts. Let's see how you like this. Se sähkö tulee. Se on kohta ne ydinvoimaa. Now answer me. How much does the CIA know? They're after my legacy, aren't they? Your real target is the philosopher's legacy, isn't it? It's no use. He's not going to talk. He's been trained not to break. Trained by me. Admit it! We're after the location of the legacy! The secret fund established by the three great powers during the two world wars. That's what you're looking for, isn't it? One hundred billion dollars, divided up and hidden all over the world. And you're looking for a record of where all that money is hidden, right? No matter. Philosopher's legacy is safely in my possession, in the underground vault of Groznikrat. Yeah. You'll never live. What's this? A transmitter? Who's responsible for this? I am. Ah. I planted it on him to keep track of his movements. Why? So the Cobras could ambush him. If they knew where he was gonna be, they wouldn't have gotten themselves slaughtered. It 
pains me to do this, boss, but under the circumstances, I'm afraid I must ask you to show me some proof that you and he were not in collusion. You don't trust me, is that it? Not that. <laughs> that the gosh, he is your apprentice. apprentice. What do you want me to do? Let's see. Cut out his eyes. I don't like those blue eyes of his. There's nothing more important to a soldier than his eyes. You made him a soldier, and now you will unmake him. Yes, it'll make for a touching display. He's all yours. Do it! Ruin him! Just as he did the Cobras! What is it, Tanya? He suffered enough. Well, well. Why are you protecting him? That smell. Tatiana, you're the spy. What are you talking about? I know that smell. Stop it! Taking a fancy tour, eh, Ocelot? No, Kova. I have no interest in this woman. I want to test her. I'll let this be the judge. Do as you like. <laughs> the bite. There, satisfied now. Well, that was refreshing. Come, we're going to my room. So you survived the colonel's torture, eh? Watching this has made me realize something. <laughs> it's really not that bad. It's the ultimate form of expression. <laughs> You got lucky this time, Tatiana. Joku snekki tiesi, että sillä on mikrofiili filmi piilossa. Se yritti niinku sitä suojella. I've prepared an escape. 
escape route for us. Go out and head west. Pass underneath the connecting passageway and go north. You'll find an open manhole there. You are quiet. Go through the manhole down into the sewers. The door at the north end of the sewers is unlocked. You can use it to get outside the fortress. I've got your equipment. We'll meet up later. Eva. But I can't get too close to your cell. You'll have to figure a way out of there yourself. I'll be in touch. Okay, on funky now, see. Ready to save Snake? Snake? <sighs> Snake? My mouth hurts when I talk. Did you get cut up? <sighs> it feels like someone shoved me under a lawnmower. Do me a favor. Tell me a story to take my mind off the pain. Snake, have you ever heard of Renfield? Is that a movie? It's the name of a character. He's locked up in a cell waiting for the master to return, eating the spiders that crawl along the walls. Uh, change the channel. <laughs> <laughs> he waits and waits for ages. Finally, just as he's beginning to forget whether he's human or not, the master comes for him, saying, The time has come. Renfield is overjoyed. Wait, isn't this? The master spreads his huge wings, and a gust of wind fills the cell. Come on, I don't want to hear this. And there, standing before Renfield in human form was... Dracula. Exactly! If you stay there too long, your old buddy Dracula is going to come and get you too. So you better start thinking of a way out of there. Oh, okay. That, that annoyed me. You better not leave me without someone to talk to. Please, Snake, think. There's got to be a way out of there. I'll try. Okay. Just let me know if you start having nightmares about Dracula. Okay. Snake? Major. You're all right. I wouldn't say all right, but at least I'm alive. That's good Jessica. enough. But they took all my weapons and equipment from me. Well, you've still got your radio and medical items with you. Yeah. I wonder why that is. Hmm. Perhaps Volgin's not finished with you just yet. Yeah, well, I'm not finished with him yet either. Snake, you've got to escape from that cell somehow. There must be a way. Use your head. Misko haarukka. Joo, okei okay, selvä. Ää, smar... Okei, okay, nyt mulla ei ole... ...haavoja. Big Death Beal. What's 
wrong? Are you okay? Oh, jeez. Did you throw up? Yeah. Well, it's now here to be a picture. <laughs> Managed to escape? Yeah, I'm out. Be careful. In your present state, you're practically naked. You don't have a single decent weapon, and you'll never survive in a battle. Take some time and pull yourself together. Eva says she's recovered your equipment, so rendezvous with her as soon as possible to get your gear back. Use the escape route Eva set up for you. Go down into the sewers through the manhole in the northwest section of Grosnigrad. Northwest. Start out by exiting the holding cells and heading northwest. Mistä me olisi arvotusnumero? Sata neljä neljä seitsemän viis, mikä oli taululle kiitsessä piirretty ja se kummajainen näytteli sitä. Eli se oli ovi, oven, oven avauskoodi. Tämä on vähän parempi, parempi tämä <laughs> selli näköjään. Have you found any weapons? I've got a fork. You call that a weapon? Without a decent weapon, attacking the enemy head-on is suicide. Until you get your gear back, your main focus should be staying out of sight. If by chance the enemy does see you, don't try to fight. Mennyt, mutta nyt täytyy päästä täältä pois. Tässä on ovi. Ovi on kiinni. Hirveästi ammuksia. On tosi äänekkäät aseet nyt. Siinä. Erinomaista. Nyt löytyy, nyt löytyy. Nyt päästiin viemäreihin viimeinkin. Snake, you're 
already in the sewers? Eva, yeah, I just got down here. Hmm. I'm coming to meet you now. The door at the north end is open, right? Uh, Snake? Let me guess. There's a problem. I know how to see it all. Yeah. What is it this time? The Colonel found out you escaped. Did, huh? I figured as much. <laughs> yeah, Yo. and now all of Grozny Grad is on red alert. Just my luck. But once I'm out of the fortress... We can't get out. I can't? When the fortress went on red alert, they sealed off the sewers. You've got to be kidding me. I'm serious. And that means the escape route I laid out is... It's sealed off, too. Right. And they just sent a unit out looking for you. Down here? Uh-huh. They'll be there any minute now. You've got to get out quick. But isn't the exit sealed off? You should be able to get out by heading straight north. Book it, Snake. If they find you, you're dead. Okay. Das muss kosten, da machst du jetzt auch jemanden. Boah, das wäre ich schon. Das wäre jetzt nicht gesehen. I've been waiting for this. Dawes. Nobody interfere. Täytyy virittää tuo aina, niin se ei välttämättä... Tuollakin voi pelata tietysti venäläistä, mutta en tiedä. Niin ei ehtiä muuta kuin vähän kertaa, kun vaihdaan liikaa. 50-50, onko sitä luoti piipussa nyt? Revolverin haittapuolia. Se olisi ollut... Joo. Neljännessä kammiossa. Tämä on yksi mielenkiintoisimmista homotappelusta tässä pelissä. whose 
lives you have ended. Tämä on ehkä mielenkiintoisimpia pomotappeluita ikinä. Tulee kaikki vastaan, mitä mä oon tappanut. Eli jos se on pelannut pasifistisesti pelin, niin... Tota noin, niin... <tos> on vähän helpompi tämä pomo tappelu. Mitä sun viime aikoina on pyrit läpi näitä aika paljon hengiltä? Väärsin hauska tilanne, jos, jos saat jotain ihan outoja tyyppejä, mitä tapaa. Excellent. Ja niin tää on tää tyyppi. No. Kyllä näitäkään ei periaatteessa tarvitse niinku... ...pomoja tappaa. tainnuttaa ne, niin tai näistä, näistäkin pääsis ohi aikaan ilmatteeksi. Eli mä oon kohtuullisen verenhimona ollut tässä perissä. Korppikotkakin on tossa. Ää, niin joo. Tää on kyllä ihan mahdollinen siltikin pelata, vaikka olisi pistänyt kaikki kylmäksi.
tää on tää. Särkkaampuja. <laughs> Tiede mieskin. Sano kyllä, että Kojima on Nero. Siis tässä on ihan nerokkaitakin piirteitä näissä, näissä sen peleissä. Okei, nyt pystyy ottamaan sitä. Revival pitin. Boss. You have to shoot me. I can't. Shoot me. You want to finish your mission, don't you? Then you'll have to shoot me. The spirit of the warrior will always be with you. Don't be sad. We'll meet. Again someday. Mm. Ei mene hirveen vahvasti kyllä. Se on jännä, kun sitä ei ole missään vaiheessa otettu tää radio pois. Snake, are you alright? That was a close call. What the hell happened to me? You were halfway drowned at the bottom of the river. Almost crossed over to the other side. Other side? So that really was. Something on your mind, Snake? Major, was there a man in the Cobra unit called the Sorrow? Yeah, I've heard of him. He was an uncanny soldier who fought alongside the boss. What kind of man was he? The Sorrow was a man with, well, special powers. He had ESP, which was the subject of extensive research in the Soviet Union at the time. He was especially gifted as a medium. A medium? Someone who can communicate with the spirit world and evoke the spirits of the dead. In other words, he could talk to ghosts. 
They say he could find out what was going on in a battle by talking to dead soldiers. What about him and the boss? What was the story between them? I don't know the details. Why don't we ask Sigurd? Yo, I finished checking up on this Sorrow guy a while ago. Thought you guys already knew, though. Knew what? That he's dead. He's been dead for two years now. Died two years ago? At Salino Yarsk. You know, those cliffs you were at. And the boss is the one who did him in. The boss? Yep. Two years ago, the boss was sent by the CIA on a secret mission to Salino Yarsk. That's when she met the Sorrow, who'd gone back to the Soviet Union after the Cobras broke up at the end of the war. Except this time, they were enemies. And then what? The boss killed the Sorrow herself and accomplished her mission. At least, that's what the records say. So, he was never there in the first place. He just couldn't let go of the boss. You okay, Snake? Yeah, I'm fine. It looks hey. like it's not time for me to die yet. I sure hope not. Otherwise, the whole mission is shot. We're counting on you, pal. Roger that. Eva? Snake, you didn't call. I was worried. Are you all right? Yeah. I took a pretty freaky detour. Mm. What are you talking about? Nothing. Forget it. Let's just say I'm back. Good. But how did you escape from the sewers? I jumped into the river. From all the way up there? You're out of control. Yeah. I got yep. carried away by the current and almost drowned. Great. That's perfect. What do you mean, that's perfect? I mean, if you ended up in the river, then I know a good spot nearby. Let's meet up there. Where is it? Keep going upstream until you get to a waterfall. A waterfall, huh? Right. Behind that waterfall, there's a cave. We'll meet in there. The cave behind the waterfall upstream. Got it. See you there. Okay, that's yellow. No niin, kaunissa luonnossa taas ollaan. Melkein ilman aseita.